one of the great things about being at UAB is that we have a number of experts in a variety of fields that are all involved in taking care of patients with brain tumors. Um, and we have a lot of experts in neurosurgery, obviously, I'm quite proud of that. But additionally, we work with colleagues in neurology and in radiation oncology. In this large group of brain tumor uh, experts, we've treated a number of patients under a wide variety of clinical trials. The clinical trials that I've been most involved in have been utilizing a special kind of virus that has been specialized for use in treating brain tumors. Um, we've been doing this at UAB now for 10 years or more and uh, have had some patients that have had excellent results in these trials. Two major kinds of viruses have been tried. Uh, our own personal interests were initially in a virus called herpes simplex virus, which is the common cold sore virus, and 90% of us have antibodies to that virus, indicating that we've been exposed to it at some time in our life. Um, this virus has been genetically engineered or had its DNA modified so that it actually is much more suitable for treatment. It makes it safe to use so that it won't cause any bad side effects, and it allows it to treat or target just the brain tumor cells and leave the normal cells untouched. We've now treated 36 patients in uh, various trials here at UAB utilizing this virus, and some of them have had quite good success. We also have a new tr newer trial open using a different virus called the Reovirus. Reovirus is another virus that is commonly found in our environment, and most of us have been exposed to it as well. However, the virus is able to attack um, cancer cells or tumor cells and, uh, and do quite well in terms of infecting these cells and destroying them. So this virus has been used all over the world in a variety of clinical trials aimed at other cancers, but we have a phase one study here at UAB um, that we're the lead institution on. And we're quite optimistic about this virus as a potential treatment for these uh, tumors as well. And that's one of the exciting aspects of being a neurosurgeon involved in brain tumor care here at UAB.